Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Deus Ex. Let us... Let us leave the hotel. This way. I wonder what's going on here. He's not my boyfriend. And what is he? He's Jojo. God! Okay. I don't like him staying in my hotel. Then evict him. How'd you get mixed up with someone like that in the first place? Jesus, Dad, do you expect me to do it? It's your hotel. Uh, I just don't want any trouble. Then get used to it. JoJo's the boss on the street. Nothing anybody can do about it. Okay. I don't know whether I should interrupt in this conversation. Let me see if it is, um, uh, what I want to happen. Okay, I completely failed to spell that. Hey, dude. What's the trouble? None of your business. One of the neighborhood thugs, JoJo. He thinks he owns the block. I can straighten him out. Just tell me where he is. I get some rough people in here, but this guy, I don't know, he's jumpy. He's just a punk. I'll take care of it. Can you help me out? I could really use a gun for protection. Ah. Uh, what am I? Sorry. Tell that. Oh, it's this gone. All right, it's important that I do not talk to them in this instance. <laughs> I do not want to talk to them. I will, however, steal your credits. If I talk to them, uh, it instigates an event, which means she runs away. And I do not want her to run away. Alright. We have images. NSF headquarters. We want to go there. I think I know where there is. I always go pay a visit to Bloodshot. To, uh, sorry, not Bloodshot. That dude. Bob. But I'm gonna go this way, because now this way's open, I don't need to do the ridiculous walk around to go get to the NSF HQ. Which is always good. No reason to be armed with a gun, after all, I'm still a member of Yunatko. Until JC decided he just wanted to betray Yunatko. I wonder what this dude's gonna say. Hello! I thought they were shipping you off to Hong Kong. I know. Had to pack a few things. What's going on here? Damage control. The NSF got their hands on some pretty sensitive material. Probably had something to do with my two-faced brother. Indeed. Nothing we can't clean up. Mind if I take a look around? Go right ahead. Yeah, let's just let the guy who's the brother of the really suspicious looking dude. Yeah, let's just let him go in. Nothing bad's going to happen at all. Idiots. You'll need to send the signal from the satellite dish on the top of the warehouse. If you're unable to hack the computers up there, you'll need the instructions and account information Lebedev sent me. One of our agents who tried to send the signal but got run off left the data cube in a secret area below the garage. Look for a hatch under some boxes. A computer on the third floor can unlock the hatch. Okay. Just keeping busy. With my gun. I... Do I really want that? Yes, actually, I do. I do actually want that. We've got a lot of work to do. Walking around with my gun. It takes a lot of work. Don't need shotgun ammo. What's it for? That's a dumb question. Really? No, really. What does Unatco need with that kind of money? Good point! Just look around. Think Unatco would be handing out assault guns if funding was left of the UN? Well... The uniforms. If it wasn't for Simons, we'd still be wearing those little white helmets. Yeah. He's what they call a philanthropist. Really? Acts this fine? Yeah, all of it. The whole directory. What I want to know is what he gets in return. Don't you know what a philanthropist is? Yeah, like Nietzsche. No, a philanthropist. Giving to charity. Yeah. Oh. Well, that's why he volunteered for FEMA. To help out after hurricanes and that kind of thing. That's a lot of money to just give away. Some people are just good, you know? Good to the bone. Yeah, like that, like that Walton Simons guy. Good to the bone. Uh, yeah. Good to the bone, my ass. I'm sorry, did I say that out loud? I think I did. Ah, 
Ah, it says we need a hazmat suit. Lucky you should know, we have a hazmat suit here. We're still really getting badly hurt here. Attack the computer. A lot of lot open. Yes, the thing with the giant circle around it. Apparently, that is not even vaguely suspicious. That beeping sound's going to help. Really. Boom. Well, I'm going to be hit anyway. Because I'm JC and I have sunglasses. Alright, down here should be the little... This is where it gets a bit painful. Do you remember in here? Oh yeah, it's one of these kind of things. Probably one of the last places that we're going to actually use um, any sort of tools. So, let's start using some tools. How many multi-tools do I have? I have five. Well, we'll use two here. See if that gets rid of all of these. Oh, it only got rid of some of them. Well, we can get rid of the others. By the way, how many skill points do I have? Not enough to make much of a difference between the electronics and lockpicking. Hey! What's the... Well, we have a million lockpicks, so let's pick the lock and see what we find. Security terminals. Love these. Let's see what we got here. Off. Open. Off. Open. Off. Open. Right. That's probably helped dramatically. Oh, yeah. Uh, gotta be careful with this. Drop it like that. <laughs> now I have access to these boxes. Luck picks and a multi tool. Hmm, not bad. I wonder. Uh, might be time to do some fleeing. Like this. Flee! 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 Oh! Crud. That was not good. Not good at all. Okay. Let me. Dynamite! Ah! That got rid of one of them. And... DYNAMITE! I could safely say now that there is no problem with them any- Ugh, I could have just bypassed all that. Ugh. When we come back, folks, we will continue the exciting adventures of Eduardo, the Unatco agent. Until then, folks. Until then.